guys, the fat vegan chick here, and I'm just making this quick video with my Poochie Pie brew. Hi, hello. Um, to tell you a bit more about my weight loss journey so far. Um, I've started this video like six times, but the dog kept wanting to play, and I kept over explaining everything and being just an idiot. So <sighs> I'm gonna try again, and maybe this time it'll go better. Anyways, so um, I'm making this video. It's really daunting for me because I've never told anyone my weight and I don't want to tell anyone my weight because I'm very ashamed of it. Um, there's no, I'm not going to give you lots of excuses and sob stories. Uh, ultimately, I ended up getting myself in this mess because I ate too much and didn't look after myself. So i um, just going to come out and say it. I'm not going to make excuses. My highest weight last year was 512 pound. Um, my, my weight when I started this journey, if the cliche term I know, um, on the 1st of January, I decided, again, those terrible, I usually hate resolutions and I never make them, but I thought, you know what, this year, I'm going to lose a hundred pound this year. I want, that's my aim. So on the 1st of January, I weighed myself and I was 490.4. So 490 pounds. Um, and as we stand now, currently I am 452 pound. And so I've lost about 38 pound um, since January 1st. So I'm, that's, I'm happy with the progress. I, wanted, I want to lose 12 pound a month. Um, what are you doing? What are you doing? You'll be cuddly, you're being cuddly. Anyways, so... £12 a month to me, £3 a week. I'm happy with that progress. I know that people my size, um, well, on reality TV and stuff, you know, that um, they uh, lose it much faster, but they have a really restricted calorie limit, and I am not into that. I don't think that's sustainable for me. So gradually, healthily, a couple of two to three pound a week I want to it will take longer but I think um it's more sustainable in my opinion for me so um that's where we stand so far um I'm I'm using my fitness fitness pal and I'm basically counting calories I'm not doing anything particularly interesting or magical or anything like that um, my fitness, my fitness pal, <laughs> my fitness pal has me estimated around, um, as needed, um, to lose two pound a week. Um, oh, wow. Words, Rachel, communicate. <laughs> my fitness pal tells me in guided mode that I should be eating around 2,400 to 2,500 calories a day. Um, I don't often do that. I've actually manually set it to be about 2,000 calories a day. I guess that pushes it a little bit more, but 2,000 calories is very easily easily doable for me and sustainable. You know, I'm not hungry on 2,000 calories, especially, well, no. <laughs> on, no, we're not, we're not even gonna get to that story. I'm, I, so basically I stick around 2,000 calories a day. Um, sometimes I'm a lot less, like if you saw my first video, um, of what I eat in a day. Genuinely didn't plan that video. Didn't try to make me seem eat seem as though I eat less than I do. Just happened to work out that day. It, um, I um, if you'd see me on a different day, would have been higher, or maybe not. Who knows? Um, so some days I eat much less. Some days I do net around twelve hundred calories. Some days I go over by a couple of calories, and I don't really. I'm not concerned with that. That's why I stick it at 2,000, because then if I do go over a little bit, I know that there's some wiggle room. Um, but yeah, how I do that is I just make, make healthier choices. I cook from scratch um, almost every dinner, and lunch just tends to be... Uh, I tend to have very small breakfast, maybe a piece of fruit or a cereal bar or something, because I'm not really a breakfast eater. Um, Sometimes I don't have breakfast at all, which is probably bad, but who knows. And then lunch, it tends to be a smaller thing. And then 
I get very hungry later on in the day so I'll tend to have a normal sized dinner and then I'll have like a smaller portioned meal type thing for supper maybe that's why I'm not hungry in the morning who knows but that's how my body works and um yeah so uh, I don't um don't restrict myself as uh oh, what's the word if I'm hungry I will eat but I'll eat healthier things so I don't I'm um, if I got to 2,000 calories and I was still really hungry, at the end of the day, I'd probably still eat something. Um, but it doesn't happen very often, so I don't. Anyways, I've completely forgot what I was going to say. <laughs> um, yeah. So that's basically how I do it. On weekends, I do like to go out with friends or... Yeah, and... and I still try and stay within my calorie limit. Sometimes I'll eat like much smaller portions in the day to make up for what I'm going to eat at night. Or, But again, if I go over a little bit, I'm not really concerned because ultimately I uh, want this to be sustainable and it's not sustainable if I'm just going to hide away all day and not do anything with anyone. So yeah, I do allow myself to have, you know, like one or two, once or twice a week to go out with friends but I always tend to pick the healthier option anyway like I wouldn't just go in and eat a 6,000 calories worth if you if you know what I mean I try to make sure it's either within my daily calorie limit or maybe a tiny bit above but that's and again that helps if I set it for 2,000 because if I go above it's not detrimental to my weight loss so it's working for me I've over explained that. I am an over explainer. I apologize. Um, so yeah, so that's how it stands right now. Um, I'm going away on holiday tomorrow for seven days. I'm taking my dad and the kids to Scotland for the week. Here's the thing with that. <laughs> I don't know how well I'm going to be. Well, I'm not going to be home that often for meal times. So I'm going to have to make sure I can find, well, priority wise, it has to be vegan, whatever I eat. Um, I'm not vegan for health reasons. I'm vegan for ethical health and environmental reasons. Lots of, that's a whole other video, which I'll make if you really want me to, but I don't think many people are interested in that, are they? Um, so yeah, um, it has to be vegan what I find. Um, and then I have to try and find something healthy and vegan which is probably going to be difficult. So, yeah. Um, I am contemplating vlogging it. Take you guys along with me. And maybe that's a good idea. Because then if I'm like, okay, I'll just have the chips instead of the salad. And then I'll have to whack my camera out and say, who, um, I'm eating chips now instead of salad. That might be a bit, like, it might hold me more accountable if I have to video everything that I'm eating. Does that make sense? I don't know. This is a really long video, I apologise. And it's just me talking really boringly. Boringly is not a word, I don't know. Is boringly a word, Prue? Is boringly a word? She said no, it's not a word. Anyway. So yeah, so I might bring you guys along with me. Actually, no, you know what? I will bring you guys along with me. You guys, like the two people that have watched my other video. <laughs> Anyways, so yeah, it's going to be interesting. I will weigh myself tomorrow. I don't think it's going to change much in a couple of days, my weight. Um, and then I'll weigh myself when I get back off holiday and see how terrible it is. The number one thing that I refuse to do on this holiday is let myself slip. I don't mind, you know, slipping for the odd meal. I'm not, I'm not slipping, that's the wrong word to use. If I want to go out and have something that's a bit more calorific than I, what I usually eat, then that's fine by me. I'll try and make up for it for, throughout the day. And you want the, you want this, you want it. Um, I'm not going to deprive myself all week of something nice. Um, but obviously, the majority of time, I need to make sure I'm eating healthier foods, which might be... Oh, I'm sorry. You want to... You, you want me to what are you doing you, you 
can't, I can't play with you now. I almost finished the video. I can't play with you now. Oh, sit. Go get it. Apparently, I have to play with my dog now. So basically, yeah. What was I, say? What was I even saying? I'm not going to completely deprive, deprive myself of higher calorie foods, but I'm not gonna binge eat and i'm gonna mostly pick the healthier choice i think i hope i will i will um and the place that we're going to also has a swimming pool splash pad thing so i'll get more swimming done um i do swim now but not as much as i'd like because of kids and this rabid little beast um but yeah so we'll see how we go and it's also going to be really really weird videoing in in front of my family and in public that's gonna be weird we'll see how we go yeah okay see you soon bye